Oh boy, boys. Yeah, we're back. Oh, we have a message. Destroy raiders. Hunt the gang of steppy raiders, bandits. Okay. Yeah. So we're back, boys. Uh, in um, this absolute disaster of a campaign that we've been playing. We've been struggling as of late. Oh, dear God. Okay. Um, how are there enemies everywhere? Oh, my God. All right. Um, yield to me, uh, and then we'll, we'll attack this. Okay. Let, welcome back to Mountain Blade. All right, boys. It's It's been no secret that we have been on the struggle bus for a hot second here. Um, so... <laughs> We need a comeback episode. Uh, we we left the um, empire because they were mistreating us, and we were peeved. However, upon forming our own empire, we have yet to really find success doing anything, anything at all. Kingdom of Dalium is. Bad! It is down bad. We are down bad, fellas. Never thought I'd say that about a kingdom, but it's pretty down bad. We did get a glaive back, and we're actually, like, we're f flush with cash. And I, I do not say that lightly. We are flush with cash. We have so much money, bro. It's kind of insane. If only that translated into kingdom success, because... Guess what? Freaking doesn't at all. Doesn't at all. There we go. Easy clap. That was nice. Well done, boys. Well done. Snaps for everyone. Um, here, you know what? You're free to go. I don't even care. <laughs> You're free to go. I don't need to keep you hostage. There we go. Y'all are Gucci, my dudes. And then we'll go ahead and take all these guys. Excellent. And then, um, we'll leave that to our boys for some added experience there. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, so we do need to go hunt some steppy bandits, but what we were doing previously was engaging with Sabir here. Um, or at least trying to engage with Sabir. I will buy some of your fine fish, sir. Thank you. Um, and we lost pretty triumphantly. Tremendously. Whatever you want to call it, we lost. We lost big time. Um, so now we're trying our darndest to <laughs> make some kind of a comeback here. Um, at the very least, there's there's not many defenders at Sabir. So we we should probably counterattack relatively soon. How long do we have on that quest? Seven days? Oh, God. No, nope, that's a big party. Run away! Okay. We only have seven days, days though, so maybe Sabir needs to wait, actually. Oh my god, this guy's gaining on us. No! Please, sir. Please, sir. Have mercy. Dear god. Um, we'll recruit you. We'll upgrade. Because we're looking at, potentially, another fight here. Oh, dear god. We're looking at another war. What else is new? Oh, trade ability. Your workshops gather trade rumors and decrease in selling animals bounty. Probably want our caravans gathering trade rumors because we have so many caravans. We also have a lot of workshops. Um. Yeah, maybe I'm the rightful ruler. I would like your support. Oh, this might work. You may know me as a man of honor. Ineffective, okay. Huh. Garius is not known for keeping his word. Okay. It is well known that you and Gary, Gary, Garios loathe each other. Okay. 
I have a strategy to win and my strategies work eventually. Yes. I see. Wait, he's just not comfortable discussing this with me? My friend! Okay, I guess we have to fight this man. I didn't want it to come to this. Oh dear god, he's powerful. Okay. Yeah, boys, we, um... We are not well prepared for this fight! We are not prepared for this fight, okay. But we gotta do what we gotta do. We gotta do what we gotta do, baby. We'll have our missile archers, of course, engage. Always a good tactic. Good daily tactic. And, of course, we're gonna... Yes! Absolutely struck down in his prime. Another one. Yes! You buffoons. You forget that I am daily. The, the killer of men. Oh my god, that's a lot of enemies. Okay, maybe we'll back off our horse archers for now. Just real quick, because they're about to... Yep, charge is pretty good here. Okay. It's fine, though. Because we are swinging the old glaive, baby. Alright, charge that cavalry. Um, and then actually, hope you guys engage. Nice! Good stuff. We're getting some nifty, swifty little kills here. I like it. I like it a lot. Boom! Yes. Okay. We need more. We need more. More kills for the army to succeed. There we go. Beautiful. Oh, God, that's a lot of archers. Maybe give me my shield. Perhaps, my leash. A shield would be nice. About. How do I get my freaking thing? There we go. Give me the glaive. Your honor. The glaive. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, come on. Come on. Come here. Ah! These elite Imperial cataphracts are nothing to mess with. They are toughies. God, they have so many freaking cab units. It's so frustrating. Ah! God, and those Imperials. All right, good. We're our infantry's doing a little bit now. Infantry. All right, maybe our infantry should charge because they just hit us with a pretty good charge themselves. Come on, keep our archers up. All right, keep after them. Keep after them, boys. All right, there we go. Whew. Nice. Come on. I'm in there. I'm getting in there for you. Alright, gentlemen. I'm trying to help out as best I possibly can. Alright, look. I'm doing my darndest. <laughs> I'm really trying to clutch this for y'all. There we go. Ugh. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm trying to work some magic here, boys. Everyone charge. I don't know how you wouldn't already be engaged, though, so... You know, there's that. Oh, man. I really don't want to lose this one, boys. There we go. As long as my steed stands tall. Go for the Bannerman. Ah, uh, he didn't die. Oh, dear God. Nope. Oh, shoot. Shoot! <laughs> God dang it. We got captured. We just lost all of our men. All right, we're finally making it out. Whoa! Wants 94K? Fine. Whatever. Made him a freaking rich man. He's lucky I'm absolutely loaded. He's darn lucky. <laughs> I just paid an absurd amount. I should not have paid that, but it is what it is, okay? It is what it is. All right. 
We are in recruiting mode, baby! We need all of the things that we love so much, including meats and certain cheeses and grapes and beer and fish. We like that fish, don't we, boss? We do like a good bit of that fish and some butter. Yummy, scrum diddly umptious. Okay, cool. Oh god, that's Achiosicity. You son of a... Gunderson. Listen, man. You just beat the crap out of me. I, you don't. You don't have to do it again. You really don't. You've probably still got like a bajillion of my soldiers in your party captive right now. I, I'm. I'm a lowly man. I don't have a lot going for me. I just don't. <laughs> I simply don't. Just leave me alone. We got some upgrades at the very least. Okay, we'll go for those real quick. <laughs> it's not gonna let us exactly stand a chance against this punk, but it's something. It is something. Um, there are some enemies over this way, but I don't really want to fight those guys either. <laughs> Can't quite explain how down bad we currently are. Okay, there we go. We be running. Are they following me? No, they're running from Agios's party. Good. Agios, follow them and not me. Ugh, you jerk. Oh my god. We are struggling. Oh, this is a rebel settlement now? Oh, interesting. Oh, that's very interesting. I only have 275 defenders? You know what? With the Western Empire, we are going to make peace. Because we can pretty easily just take on these rebels here instead. Um, we're not going to just yet. But when the time comes, uh, these, these guys should be an easy... Oh, come on. They're going to swoop in, aren't they? Uh, maybe not. Hopefully not. Oh, we got a baby. Cool. Pug. Alright. Um, well, if those guys swoop in, we're not going to be able to enact our plan. If they don't, uh, then we're going to be able to go get Tyal right there from the Rebels. Which would be pretty darn swell, if you were to ask me. Um, so let's make our way through the recruiting rounds here. Upgrading as we go as well. Because Lord knows we need to, baby. Okay, we've done a lot of recruiting. Like, a lot. We are still looking at a very weak army. No! They're sieging it. You jerks! That was my territory to conquer. No! Ah, let's head back this way. I mean, yeah, uh, I, I highly doubt they lose this. I mean, the odds of them losing this is just like... Nil. It's just not gonna happen. I mean, we'll keep a, keep tabs on it, but like, I doubt the attacking army loses to these rebels, so that's gonna be tough for us. That's gonna be tough. Look at this. These rebels over here have been growing. What, what you guys been doing? You guys still don't want to ever join me? Okay. Um, well then, goodbye. Actually, did quite a number on us there, but... Uh, yeah, that gave us a lot of upgrades. Thank God we needed that. So someone in the last comment section basically said you can click this button and have these people just come to you. Which is amazing because I used to individually go to the places they were staying and go get them. So it's pretty awesome that I can just have them come to me now. That is fan freaking fantastic. Thank you. To the person who told me about that. Um, so we're recalling all of those people to us right now. Someone also told me that you could actually put a cap on um, the amount of money that different uh, settlements are allowed to spend, which is also extremely helpful because those settlements are thus not going to be able uh, to be a huge pain in the butt, you know? So it's, it's pretty pog. It's pretty pog. 
because um, then, then you're not draining money, basically, is what I'm trying to say, but failing to do so. Uh, there's another supply line thing. From Sionion? Where the heck's Sionion? All the way over there. All right, we'll head that way. We'll, we'll do this supply run uh, mission because we've not done the last few missions. Um, it's becoming apparent to me that perhaps doing these missions would actually be helpful towards us in the long run <laughs> of not losing this campaign outright. So let, let's head towards that. Um, and also it'll give us some good XP since our army is extremely green. These guys are very weak that we're rocking right now. All right, we've just about made it here and we did a ton, a ton of recruiting. So we're actually one away from being maxed out on recruiting, which is just glorious. Really love that. There we go. We're maxed out and our party did gain some XP. Um, so we've been upgrading a little bit as well. We're like right around the two to three uh, experience uh, looking like that. So that's pretty decent. But the best part is all of our folks well, now ended up joining us. Um, so we can go ahead and form some caravans in here. And we are going to form well, now, um, quite a number of caravans with pretty much everyone here because that is going to be our main source of money at the moment. We have been lacking a little bit of money because all these caravans got shut down during our war with the Western Empire, but there we go. Um, now our caravans, yep, there they all go. <laughs> oh, they're beautiful, they're beautiful. Okay, now we just gotta wait for the enemy caravan to show up. Oh, there we go, there's the conspiracy caravan. We're going after him, baby. Let's roll. Um, Oh, they're just faster than us. <laughs> but we're faster in the woods, which is good. Uh, we should do last minute upgrades before we end up engaging. Again, we're pretty weak, so I do expect some fairly high losses here, even though um, we are outnumbering them by quite a bit. And it's almost evening us out. That's how low our power is. Yeah, dude, look at this. Look how many just standard <laughs> infantry soldiers we have. That is so bad. Holy cow. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, well, we'll go have our um, ranged horsemen go ahead and, and just start attacking there. Um, oopsie. And then, you know what? Yeah. Charge our cav as well because they're... Oh my god, they have so much cavalry. It's always the worst. You don't like them having oodles of cavalry. Luckily, our cavalry is Kuze Cavalry, which tends to be, like, some of the best cavalry in the world. So, that will help ever so slightly. Ah! Oh, this is a butcher fest, isn't it? Holy cow. We're actually kind of coming out on top against these guys. That is decent. Nice. Yes, look at that. Okay. They do just have so much more cavalry than us, though. That's okay. That is okay. Because we've still got our archer cav, which should be taking some shots here. And, of course, we have all of our infantry, too, so... We're, we're fine. We're fine. Ow. My stupid conspirators. Okay. There we go. Our cavalry's dead. That's ripped to them, basically. All right. All right. God, look at our infantry is so weak. We haven't had this week of infantry in a long time. Who are you? Conspiracy Knight coming out of freaking nowhere. Coming out of left field. All right, we'll go ahead and charge our 195 footmen here. Going to try and soften up some of these stronger looking knights. There we go. Because our footmen, oh yeah, they're getting butchered. They are having a rough go at it. That is tough. <laughs> Our boys are so weak. So unbelievably weak. Here we go. Oh! I got absolutely sniped. It's up to our boys. We should be able to win this just by sheer numbers, but I mean, still, they're they're butchering us, man. They got so many kills on us. It's a little embarrassing. It's a little bit embarrassing, but there we go. We get the win. With a lot of deaths on our side. Uh, we'll set the troops for the last bit there. Uh, we can't take a prisoner. I forgot about that. It's kind of a shame. Um, okay. Do those upgrades. And they actually have 
quite a bit of goodies here. I'm going to take it. I'm going to take the goodies. Um, but there we go. Quest completed right there. Beautiful. It's about dang time that we go ahead and complete another one of those quests. And we got to go back to doing some recruiting now because we just lost so many soldiers. We didn't even really get that many upgrades from that, which is the saddest part, I think. We just lost everyone and didn't get any upgrades. So that's so fun. So fun. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, yeah. Tial did get retaken. We should probably go to the Southern Empire and see what's up with them. We haven't been there in a while. Maybe they're weaker now, and we could actually go ahead and, and take some of them on. I don't know. Uh, Varon over here has always been loyal to us. So, yep, they do have some good soldiers for us that we can yoink. Legetta. It's probably terrible. Oh, one of our clan members is with child. Avenas. Good stuff. Now, I do want to actually, I want to try something. Well, first off, I didn't mean to go into this menu, but while we're here, we do have some upgrades, which is nice. Good. Okay. Um, but I do want to go ahead and go to... No, no, no. Go to clan. And then... Nozon. Come to me, please. We're going to try and make an army out of him. I don't know if this is actually possible... But if it is, that could really help us in wars and stuff like that, you know? But that's a pretty decent chunk of looters. Ah, they're already getting fought. Dang it! That was going to be my easy way to <laughs> upgrade my soldiers. Oh, well, there's a decent number. We'll go kill them real quick. Um, but yeah, so if we can actually go ahead and have our man there. I think that's actually canonically our brother or something like that. If we can get our bro uh, to actually command a force with us then taking a city will be a lot easier with two armies instead of one. Uh, our troops can just have that stuff as upgrades. Good stuff. So I just tried creating an army with nose on here. It doesn't seem to work, so... I don't... Yeah, I don't think we're going to be able to. He also puts us over the troop limit. Well, that's fine. We'll just have him in our army as another leader, which is, you know, that works. Oh, we're having soldiers desert? Wait, why? Wait, how did our troop limit just plummet? It was in the 290s. Oh! Shoot, I assigned him as the quartermaster by accident. Um. Okay, you're now the engineer. Does that make our limit go up? Yes, okay. I'm back to being the quartermaster. Okay, which means we're back to having a higher troop limit. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. We are a mess, aren't we? We are truly, truly a mess. That's fine. Alright, we're back up. Okay. Um, basically, we're heading towards Cyronia just to see- Oh, they captured another city! The Southern Empire is on the come up, dude. Okay, interesting. Oh, there's like no defenders here. Now there's gonna be a ton of defenders here. Uh-oh. Ah, well, we could take them. Um, actually, wait. Oh, you're the king, so I can't actually turn you. Um... Maybe I overthought this. Apparently, they're kind of strong. And we're still probably pretty weak. Uh, <laughs> maybe I should have thought about this a little bit more. Hmm. It is what it is. We're, we're in this thing now. We're in this thing now. Let's, let's take care of business. All right. Have you guys engage. Oh, they have so much cavalry. That is such a problem. Why do they always have so much cavalry? Why? Alright, my cavalry follow me. Let's see what we can do here. Mayhaps something. Hopefully they're kind of disjointed or whatever. Oh, who are you? Random dude? Oh, nine damage! Nice! <laughs> they're kind of all over the place. Maybe this will work for us. Go ahead and charge our cavalry. Just for fun! Nice, two kills. And some of our cav is actually doing something. That's good. 
Uh, you know what? Nah, cavalry back up. They're leading us right into their main force. Oh, nice. Whew. And a few early kills here. There we go. Alright, we don't want to die, though. That is for sure. Don't want to die. Alright, now charge. Nice. Come on. Ugh, they have so much cavalry. They have so much cavalry. Compared to us, they are cavalry kings. We are cavalry peasants. Why does everyone always have so much cavalry compared to us? Please stop it. I need to be at like war with the sturgeons. Non-cavalry people. People of the foot, as they call them. <laughs> they totally call them that. Ah, you have a pokey stick. Please, sir. Ah, dang it. I swung way too early there. There we go. That'll do it. Oh, the Glaive is so good anti-cavalry, though. At the very least, we're getting a lot of kills ourselves. Just personally. Yep, poisonly. We're doing pretty decent. Which is nice. Always kind of a good thing. And they seem not super keen on full-on attacking us yet. Kills are even currently. Good. Good. Alright. Oh, they might be going for a cavalry charge. They might be doing a full swing in here. We'll see. They're doing it without their infantry. I'm cool with it, homie. Alright. Charge our infantry. Come on. Engage us, you cowards! They don't have too many full-on elite cavalry units, which is good. Ow. Alright. Come on. Engage us! Oh, they're just swarming around. Being annoying! There we go, there's a few kills. Alright, hold here, soldiers. Hold here. Bowman, Bowman. Bowman come up as well. Archers. Yeah, Bowman go like right there, probably. They're coming around again. Who's this jabroni? There we go. Got him. Whew. Alright, we're up in terms of kills right now. Okay. Oh, the triple. There we go. All right. Charge. Oh, we killed Regea. That's the king. That would be the king right there. That's pretty big for us. Ooh, I am like one health now. Gonna want to take a step back. Just get some shots off. No! Okay. And that's probably gonna be it. Oh. Now we're getting slaughtered. Can we get away? Yeah, we could try to get away. Alright. Let's peace out of here. <laughs> Alright, thank God we got away from that. That uh, could have ended a lot worse for us, but luckily for us, we, we did manage to swing it away. Um, yeah, they, uh, they took me down and then just started slaughtering our infantry. Our infantry is so weak! So bad. I really wish they weren't so weak as I recruit looters to pad our stats. Yeah. That's our life right now. Let's go to Poros. Alright, we're a little bit back on track here. I got some more recruiting done. Our soldiers who are wounded are no longer wounded. I think what we're going to do is we're going to go here and force the peasants over here to... Oh, hello. My friend. We, um... You know, we just had a had a meeting. It it didn't go very well. I think um, I'm gonna need some time before I feel comfortable hanging out again. That didn't get us all that much experience. 
Um. Oh my god, we're so slow. Oh my god, we're so slow. Oh my god, we're so slow. No. Do you have anything to say? <laughs> um. What would it take? Not even 549,000 dinars would convince her. And all of my stuff. Um. We could try again! We're at least, like, a, 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 a smidge stronger than last time. Oh my god, they have so much cavalry. They have so, so, so much cavalry. 74 cavalry. Why do you need that much cavalry, huh? Why? What's the freaking point of that much cavalry? Okay. I get it. You want to destroy your enemies. Me being that enemy. Um, let me just tell you. It's not very cool, dude. Okay. It's just kind of lame. Kinda freaking lame. Oh, I'm I'm trying. I'm try harding, dude. I'm trying very very hard. We're gonna charge our infantry as well. Try and combat some of this cavalry right off the rip this time. I think last time. We definitely struggled a little bit with having our cavalry and infantry fight separately. But this time, we're going all in. Going all in with the blokes. Okay. Come on, baby. Come on, boys. Pull through. Oh my god. Oh my god. They are on a rampage! Shoot. Alright, we're gonna retreat. And we're gonna try and get away. Okay, there we go. We out of there. We out. <laughs> we're gonna wait here for some time. Oh, they're going to Annika. Are they about to siege? Oh, no. They're just chilling. Nice. <laughs> okay, another close call. Oh, yo, they just split up, though. They just, uh... They just freaking split up, though. Hold up, I'm actually really low on food. Um, before we go mess around with these folk... We're gonna need some serious food. There we go. There we go. Okay. Hold on. Hold the phone. And take some of you guys on. Individually. If you get over here. Come on. Come on, man. Come on, man. Come on, son. Ugh. They're all just faster than me because I have wounded. Taking advantage of poor wounded men. Disgusting. Disgusting. Oh, there's a marriage thing? Sure. I always accept the marriage things, because I have no idea what it does. And that's my way. Oh, we could go kill these guys. After they deal with some local bandits, we'll swoop in. Oh, wow, look at all those looters. Oh, we'll go kill them instead. Nice. Yeah. Alright. Send troops. Nice. 20 upgrades, finally. Getting some upgradable soldiers here. That is what I like to see, baby. Thank the Lord. All right. Whew. What is this? Um, hunt the gang of sea raiders. Okay. We can go do that. Um, where are they at, though? Yo, where are these sea raiders at, though? Are they not just, like, around the map? Apparently not. Okay, uh, do we have to, like, look for them? Because that's annoying. Varnapole. Alright, that's looking wintry. Ah, oh, it's up there. Dang it! Okay, we'll head up there and do some hunting, and that'll hopefully actually upgrade our soldiers to the point where we're able to do some 
real freaking fighting here. Okay, so we just defeated all of those boys, and now there's a conspiracy war party here um, that we have to go attack, which should be pretty easy for us. And also, we've been getting upgrades from these attacks, so this is actually really nice. This is helping us upgrade our soldiers, which is so desperately freaking needed. Now, the only main problem we're still sort of having is our serious lack of cavalry. So I'm actually going to purposefully keep a lot of our cavalry back. Actually, no. You know what? We got we to gotta counter their own cavalry here with our cavalry. So we'll do that. Um, but I was going to keep them back so they don't die. Why did I do this? This was so stupid. Get me out of here. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Yeah, we outnumber them by a lot. So this should be easy sweep. We're also not mega weak like we were previously. We've got a little bit of something going for us here. So... We should be able to do a little something. Okay, they're still stronger. They're still the stronger army. That's what this growth is all about, baby. That's what these fights are about. It's about making us stronger. Ah! Despite the fact that I, like, I've been struggling with these armies for so long. We're just so weak, man. Starting our own army without the backup of another like <laughs> three armies in a kingdom at the very least with us has been an extreme struggle bus for us so it, it has certainly been tough here you guys get the kill there you go there you go nice Woo! we did it thank good oh my god we finally cracked another victory and now we get some serious upgrades Thank God, yes! We love to see it. We absolutely freaking love that. Oh my God, those upgrades are so needed. Um, and we'll, we'll leave this stuff for experience as well. Beautiful. Oh my God, thank goodness. Oh, that was a really, really nice quest for us right there. That was gorgeous, okay. Ransom our prisoners there. Do we have anything to trade? Not really. We'll, we'll trade that. We don't need it, to be honest. Um, I'll take some mules. Take some mules. Why not? And uh, we'll take some more food while we over here. We'll take all your fish and all your grain and all your butter and all your meats. Thank you. Okay. Now, let's head back to the Southern Empire to continue fussing with them and, and seeing if we can't can't do something against them a little bit here because we need to. We're starting by checking out their old settlement over here since I think a lot of their armies are going to be at the new settlement. Um, there are a couple armies here. I could try and take them on. They just might be faster than us though. Um, 3.6, 3.3. Yeah, they're faster than us. We're so slow. Um, could go ahead and do a little raid though. We'll send troops against them. Boom, easy claps. Take them all prisoner. And then boom, we get some more upgrades from that as well. That's the name of the game right now, boys. Upgrading. It's what we gotta do desperately. Alright, so we'll start raiding here. Um, oh, they have a thousand defenders. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to take this one. That's just not happening. Um, we might be able to take the other one if it hasn't been, um, you know, fully defended just yet. It might still be fairly weak, to be honest. So, yeah, that could work for us. Uh, but for now, we're just going to go ahead and do do some raiding. We'll raid their other village here as well for good measure. And then we're going to go um, check out what they got in the other settlement. Okay, there we go. That's done. Beautiful. Let's head to the other village here. Yo, I think an army over here just disbanded or something. So that's a lot of soldiers. I don't think added up we could really take them on super easily, so... That's why I avoided fighting them right there. But if we could at least snag one of them to fight, that'd be pretty nice. Um, we're fast in the woods, but we're not fast outside of the woods. Okay, yeah, we'll just go to Lycaron right now. See what we could do there. I think with 291 soldiers... Oh, they have 539 defenders now? Bruh. They've already beefed up their defenses. That's so frustrating. Someone fight me! 
the problem with having a large army, dude? You're really slow. <laughs> it's really obnoxious. Okay, yeah, I don't think... I'm really gonna manage to catch anyone over here. And on top of that, um, we have another mission all the way over in Turby, which is pretty friggin' far away. Um, so we're gonna start heading towards that way. I'm still hoping to maybe catch Regea here, but they're a lot faster than us. Just, it would only work if they, like, slipped up somehow, which they're not going to, I bet. So, I guess we're, we're heading off this way to Derby Castle. Oh my god, it's so far away. Seriously? Man, what? Why are these missions making me go so far away? How long do I have? 17 days? Alright. I gotta take 10 to get there, dude. I gotta take for freaking ever to get there. At least it'll give us time to get more upgrades. We have found the conspirator hideout over here. Um, so we're... I wanna go ahead and attack this. Um, it could be a little bit hard because the last conspirator hideout was, in fact, quite hard. <laughs> but we'll try our best. Alrighty then, let's do this boys. Uh, so right off the bat, putting you guys on fire at will. Have at it lads. Oh, oh, sorry. And follow me. Actually, you know what, we'll have you charge. Uh, but I will join in on the fighting this time around. Uh, last time I sat out, actually this just looks like a normal hideout. These just look like sea raiders. Um, oh, maybe not. There might be a few more than just standard sea raiders and stuff. Oh yeah, those are conspirator fighters. Okay, that makes it a little bit harder. Um, yeah, so last time we did this, we ended up um, having a little bit of a hard time because they were conspirators and I was expecting regular bandits, which resulted in, uh, uh, well, a number of my men dying. Uh, but this time around, it looks like they are conspirators, so I'm going to fight with them. Oh, nice job. They, they dropped him right quick right there. Alright, and we of course have our bowmen firing away too, which is helpful. Nice, and then we have two random elite soldiers going forward too. <laughs> our two random blokes. Okay, where are you guys going up there? Is that where we're headed? There's another guy like way off over that way. Is this like the main hideout? Really? Well, we'll leave that to the... Uh, the crossbowmen down below. And our boys are going nuts in here. Oh my god. They are going nuts, but they... Oh, one died. Sad. That was actually kind of a powerful unit. But our other guy! Dude, they were like one or two V like fiving or something like that. Sixing, something crazy. Uh, and they almost had it. They almost had it. Well, the other guy was an Imperial Cataphract, which is an extraordinarily powerful unit. Actually kind of sad to have lost him. But it is what it is. Okay, I guess we're done up here. Um, oh, and there's another cave down that way that our crossbowmen are going into alone. That is rather worrying. Okay, we better hop to it getting over there. Because <laughs> they could easily die. Oh, yeah, there goes one of them. That was a sword sister going down. There we go. Kingsguard got a kill. Please don't die, Kingsguard. You are a valuable soldier. I don't have many of you. Oh, my God. I believe this is where, yep, our action is taking place. <laughs> we have found the dead bodies. There, there's no sign of our other soldier, though. I don't know where he has gone. Don't like that one bit. Um, where are you, King's God? I hear someone. Uh oh. No, one of our champions went down. Oh, sad. Oh, my God, what the heck? Bro! Oh! King's Guard, you're a beast. Well done. Is that it? Oh, God. Oh, the big fight. The big fight is here. Okay. Ooh. Ah, uh, we could challenge him to a duel. Okay. We're dueling. Can't let him get too close. 
There we go. We got him. Are they going to attack? Yes. All right. Beautiful. Thank God we did that duel because I think we would have been crushed. Um, oh, wow. Banner Knights of Landy and Sergeant? Wow. Wow. Okay, those are good units they're giving us as replacement units. That's nice. Get rid of the Hillman. Yeah. Uh, we can't take them captive. Um, we'll take that stuff. Why not? It's not that much experience. All right, cool. There you go. It's another little doodad down. Love to see it. Okay. Now we got to figure out what we're attacking. Tial has uh, become available again uh, as they have more riders there, but it seems difficult. We'll head back to the Southern Empire. All right, we finally back over here, boys. Um, we have increased our speed a little bit by adding some more horses to our party, um, which is good, but... Oh, no. <laughs> no, no. That's a bit much. That's a bit much for us there. 500 soldiers. I mean, I've been doing the upgrades, but... That's a bit much for me. <laughs> don't you know? I mean, don't get me wrong. I'd love to fight that, but that's um, that's a tall order. That is a tall order. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna dip away from that. Turiados, let me kill you, please. Ah, oh, they're just so much faster than us. How can we increase our speed anymore? We're not like hindered by anything. It's just so annoying. I want to be able to kill these guys. Oh, 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 we're gonna catch up. Come on. <laughs> we need him to go in the woods because we have perks that let us go faster in the woods. Yes, we got him. Okay. Yes. Come to me. Ineffective. No. Wait. Yes, effective. Okay, wait. Uh, it doesn't seem to matter. We'll do that one. Good. All right. Good. I'm simply not comfortable discussing this with you. All right, then you're gonna die. Look, I gave you a chance. Yeah, you're my prisoner. Sucks for you, but at the same time, I don't care. <clears throat> You suck. You won't join my party. No one will join my party, probably because I don't have any castles or anything to offer them at all. So, yeah. That's great. Okay. Man, I feel like we need to go to war with someone who actually has castles. Could go to war with the Vlandians and take some of their castles that are like way deep in here. That might be the play. Because then we- Ooh, that guy's got a very large party now. Um, because then we'd actually be able to fight, you know? Um, uh, and, and get people to join our side. Be nice. Be really nice. Yo, Sabir just became available again because they rose up against their lord. That's my boy, Sabir. And Sabir is pretty far away from the uh, Northern Empire, so I kind of doubt they're going to go back for it. Which- you know, it's fine by me. So if we can make it there on time before like anyone else gets any funny ideas, we might be able to actually go ahead and snag Sabir right there, which would be freaking awesome. I would love to have Sabir back, man. That would solve a lot of our problems. So we're going to hightail it that way. Bro, and I kid you not, we just got a freaking supply line quest for Sabir, which Oh, it's, it just all works out. No! We were too late. The freaking Kuzates wants to be here now? Why? Why do they want to be here? Like, bro. Y'all are coming deep into my tundra turf. I want you guys freaking gone. Stop coming back to Sabir. Oh, that's so frustrating, man. We're always so close. We're always so freaking close, bro. 
God dang it. Thing is, I like the Kuzates too. They're fun to fight again, or fight with and stuff like that, so it's kind of a bummer. They keep on yoinking the stuff that we want. Um, we'll help your party and send troops. There you go. You're my prisoner. Good stuff. At least we actually do have a, a, a semi elite army now. Uh, you know, we're actually looking fairly decent, to be honest. So uh, I'm liking that stuff at the very least. But beyond that, just don't have a place to call home. All right, here's the conspiracy caravan. They're pretty large. We're going to go ahead and attack them uh, and, and fight this one. See what we can't do. Um, Nozon, why don't you take the infantry there? All right, so we're still fairly heavy on the infantry front, but not to the degree we were at before, which is very nice. So they got 41 cavalry. We're going to wait a bit and then charge our cavalry against them. All right, charge the cavalry and charge the infantry as well. That's the play. Hopefully, we come out of this big with little to no deaths, and we are doing great thus far, which is awesome. I feel like you should be able to double tap people with this, you know? Get double kills. That, that'd be cool. That'd be cool, man. <laughs> All right, thus far, doing great. All right, we'll go engage our missile cavalry. Um, yeah, I think, I think we're doing well. I think we could keep this up. Come on. We could have very few actual deaths. That would be fantastic. I'm at a couple deaths, but nothing too crazy thus far. All right, good. Yeah, and most of these are just wounded that are coming from our side too, which is good to see because we are actually a pretty good surgeon. So uh, that increases our ability to not have troopers actually die, which is fan freaking fantastic. Okay. I'm actually almost dead myself though, so go into archer mode. Oh, and I got shot off my horse. Awesome! I always lose more soldiers after I die. So annoying. So annoying. But there we go. We got the dubski. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. All right, we can't take you prisoner yet. Uh, but look at that! Tons more upgrades for us, baby. That's what I'm talking about. That's what we like to see, boys. Whew! Loads of upgrades. Loads and loads. Good stuff. Alright. Now what? Oh, nothing. Okay, cool. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. Alright, we are not at max capacity here, but that's okay. Uh, Sabir's getting taken, whether I like it or not. So there's that. Um, I mean... I like the idea of attacking someone who's kind of on the outskirts. The Northern Empire, man, they're just so powerful. They scare me to attack. They really, really do. Hmm. They're, they're just a little too powerful for me. I mean... The Sturgeons aren't super mega powerful anymore, but they're all just so condensed. It's way too condensed for us. Um, yeah, I really think going over to uh, Vlandians and messing with them in the desert over here is probably going to be our best bet. Um, still a risk, still a major risk, but probably the best solution I can think of somewhere sort of out of the way for us to establish ourselves and they won't really be able to come for us super easily so let's try that it might not work but you know hopefully we can get somewhere with this at the very least all right we traveled real far out here so here's what we're gonna do we're gonna go over to uh, Vlandia um, and we are going to declare war. Boom! Easy clap. <laughs> well, that was the easy part. Let's besiege this castle. They have 244 defenders. I'm going to be somewhat fast with this because they could be coming at us 
um, with an army relatively quickly, so we want to make sure we get in here pretty quick and get out. Okay, so we're real quick going to recruit every one of the prisoners that wants to join us. And then we're going to go ahead and lead an assault. So we are overmanned currently, but that actually works fine um, because we are, are doing fine here with uh, being overmanned. Since a bunch of people are probably going to die anyway. <laughs> oh, this is that really, really hard castle. Oh, great. They did not want to give us an easy one, did they? Alrighty then. Um, well, we're gonna sally on up here and then ditch our horse really quick. Alright, and see what we can't do. With the snipes! Okay, that guy dodged pretty easily. There we go. Now oh, they're all moving. They are moving. Okay. They do have catapults and whatnot. They're getting into position. It's hard to hit them when they're moving like this. There we go. Try to get a few kills here. There we go. Nice. We are not that weaker army that we used to be. We are strong. We are powerful. We shall destroy these guys. Hopefully. Please. This was not the location on the map I ever had plans of setting up in. We were a very winter territory oriented place, or even just like a midsection, and the desert, I didn't get any perks for the desert. So, that makes life a smidge harder for battles like these, as well as just like moving around the desert and stuff. Um, but this is definitely the easiest way to currently fight an enemy is locating ourselves in the desert here. Wow, they just have so many archers. Holy cow. I guess uh, these guys do have some pretty good skills with long bows and, or sorry, sh short bows rather, not long bows. Uh, that would be more the European style nations. So uh, it does make sense that they have quite a number of missile units up in here, which makes life a little bit tricky. All right, I'm moving out. I'm out of ammo. There's a battering ram. I don't really care about that. I want to go for our siege engine over this way. Keep firing, boys. Keep firing. 23 to 27. 24 to 27 now. I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. You know what? It's, it's doing a lot better than I would have ever thought. Give me some of these arrows, please. God, it takes so long to pick them up. It takes so long to pick them up. Please don't shoot me. Please don't shoot me. There we go. Okay, cool. Seven arrows that we can utilize here going up. God, that's a, a lot of soldiers. Oh, they're they're warriors though. They are weak. They are very, very good, clearly, with their archers, but those warriors are looking shabby. They are not looking super pristine. I like that. I like that a lot. Alright. Let's hop up there. Whew! So where the big things happen. That man is holding a rock. That is a little bit scary. Alright, boys. Get to killing. Come on. Oh, man. This sucks for this. Can I have a different weapon? Anyone got a different weapon? I'll take that arrow. I'll take anything, man. I'll take anything other than the stupid glaive. I love the glaive, but at the same time, I hate the glaive for sieges. Siege battles with the glaive kind of suck, man. It is not good in hand-to-hand. -hand. Very good on horseback, though. Oh, my God, yeah. You see that? Doing, like, negative brick damage here. Oh, my God. I'm doing, like, no damage. Oh, my God. All right. Our soldiers went down. Bye-bye. <laughs> Can I shoot from the ladder? That's crazy, you can! I'm heading down though. Okay, wait. Maybe not. We should be getting soldiers back up here eventually. Oh my god. Are you on the ladder right now? Homie? 
What the heck? What is happening? Do you have our archers help helping us out? Come on. Where are reinforcements? Seriously. Oh! No, no, no! Sad. Okay. When are our reinforcements coming in? Come on. This has got to be happening soon. Okay. I'm seeing some more kills. It's good. Good to see. Oh, they're, they're moving. They're shifting. Oh, my God. Give me that sword, please. No, I died. Alrighty, then. We just have to hope. There's our reinforcements. Get in there, boys. Start laying down the smack. There you go. There you go, fellas. Alright. Hopefully we do get a victory here. There we go. Very nice. Okay, there's the reinforcements. I gotta remember to put the glaive away during siege battles, man. It's so important. So important. There we go. There's a big, big victory there. Alrighty then. Whew. Good stuff, boys. Good stuff all around. Real proud of you fellas. Look at that. Look at that. Look at all the the upgrades we got going. Whew. Love to see it. I will take the extra prisoners. Because we can just store them in the dungeon. Banner of Shifting Sands. Increases troop movement speed by 0.08. That's pretty good, but I like the range damage better, to be honest. I'll take the loot. They shall take the loot. We're going to show mercy. Good. Now go to the dungeon. Manage the prisoners. Toss all those fellas in there. Goodbye. Actually, we will take some of these higher ranking ones. Maybe they'll join us. Or something. I don't know. Um, and then we need to manage the garrison as well here. Now, here is the tricky part. So, we're going to give them some of our lower ranking soldiers. But we can't give them too much because we can't leave ourselves completely in the lurch here. You know what I'm saying? Like, it, it's just... We need an army, too. Um... Yeah, so it's a little bit tough. It's a little bit tough with that, but that's what we could afford to give them right now. Um, and we're, we're going to go recruiting around and stuff like that, of course, too. I do expect the Vlandians to come after us. I do fully expect that at some point here, so we got to watch out. Um, they do have some actually fairly sizable armies. They do. Um, in this area, too. Oh. Our place already got besieged. How? Like, excuse me? I did not pass a, a sizable army at all. It's just one of those lords sieging it right now? Yeah. That would be kind of crazy. Let's go find out. We just wanted to destroy some of those guys first, though. Take your meat. And your cheese, and my soldiers can deal with the rest. Um, okay. Oh! They made quite the army. Alright, can we make peace? Wow, we'd be paying a lot of tribute every day. But screw it, we're gonna do it. That way we keep our castle. That's the big thing there. That's basically why we did that, was that we can... Now keep our castle here. Um, and I am going to toss some more lower ranking fellas in here. We might be paying a lot of tribute, but we have a lot of money right now. Um, and... Okay, that's decent enough. Okay, and then with all of that, you know, figured out, squared away, all that good stuff... We're not at war with these guys. We can now head towards the Southern Empire and potentially get some of them to actually join our side now because we have something to offer them. Um, what do they want me to do? Oh, 
the little hideout thing. All right, we'll go deal with that as well. Um, so yeah, this is the grand strategy. You know, make peace with our once enemies to then offer our actual enemies some stuff. <laughs> That's what we're doing. I know. Sometimes my brain even impresses me. That's how good we are. <laughs> I have no idea what I'm saying. Alright, get rid of all that crap. We don't need it. I don't need it. Actually, we do need some food, though. Let's go ahead and stack some food. Um, give me the meat. Give me the grain. Give me the fish. I'll pay 60 grand for that. Holy cow. Well, it is what it is. Okay. Let's head over to this hideout. I just realized I didn't pay 60 grand for that. I got 60 grand for that. What was in there? Well, like, what did I just sell off? What? what did I just sell? Oh my god. Okay. So I got us to the point where we're fighting the conspiracy fighters now. Um, and we could duel again. All right, I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. Uh oh. Uh oh. Take out the thing. Uh oh. Oh jeez. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh jeez. Oh, this is not good. Oh, he's faster. No! Shoot! Glaive. Sucks, bro! Okay, well that's sad. We failed that one. Yeah. Twas a bit of a yikes. <laughs> that's my bad. Hey, t -all's back to being enemies with folks again. Very epic. Alright, let's go over here and try and talk to some of these enemies of ours. Try and get, us, get them to join our cause now that we actually own territory. It took a really long time, but we got this guy. All right. Oh, he's part of a family, so he won't leave his clan. Oh my god. That, that took ages for no reason. We, we gained nothing from that. Fantastic. <laughs> Back to the drawing board. Given our overwhelming cash, I think it's about time we make some upgrades to the old uniform here. Um, so we're getting a, a spicy helmet right there. Do they have any good armor? Ooh, that armor is pretty spicy. Um, I kind of like it. I'm going to go for it. That's 217k. It's awfully expensive, um, but we can afford it for sure. We're going to be out of the Millionaire's Club, but um, I'm cool with it. It means we're getting protected more, and uh, I think that's definitely a good thing. We're waiting here uh, for a few days uh, for those caravans to show up at Tial here. There's a pretty big army here, and I want to take it on. They're going to run away from me. No way. Oh my god. Um, well, first of all, do you want to join us? No, okay. Surrender or die. Let's go. Let's fight it. I think we're strong enough now. All right, here we go. Here we go. Yeah, they don't have too much uh, cavalry, which really helps us out. All right, archers down there, or up here. And then we'll have you guys engage. No, no, no. No, no, no. <laughs> Shoot. Yeah, go engage. Um, and then horsemen charge because it looks like they are going to counter charge us with their own horsemen. Which is a little bit silly of them. Oh no, these are their archer boys. But <laughs> it's all the same. Beautiful. Alright, there's our horsemen going off. Go off, kings! Do some damage. Yeah, all right, there's their counter charge, but we should come out on top here. Oh, <laughs> our bro died. Rip, my man. At the very least, he's just injured. 
All right, we are losing a little bit. That's probably the weaker recruits, like the caravan soldiers we've picked up and stuff like that. Not too worried about them. All right, there we go. Imperial Equite dead. That's pretty big. Oh, wow. We're actually doing a mean number on our cavalry, so we're going to pull out. Maybe our cavalry is not quite up to snuff yet against their cavalry. And that is okay. Oh, there goes one of their leaders. I'll take that. Gladly. Okay. Our cavalry dipped. Beautiful. Oh, dang it. I wanted to get that guy. Okay, they're going to continue to charge against us here, so we'll charge our cavalry back in. Nice infantry. Nice. All right. Our archers are firing away. That is beautiful. All right, here comes their cavalry. These are these are some heavy shock cavalry units. So they will pack a bit of a punch. There we go. Oh, there we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right. All right, our cavalry come back now. I think we eliminated all their cav there for the most part. I like that. And their infantry is looking actually pretty weak. No wonder it was giving us such good odds. They're sending in their archers, but you know, our archers should be able to outpace these guys by a lot. And take them down a peg. All right. We still gotta get a better bow, by the way, because we can now use every type of bow while on horseback, which is kind of insane. We can use even long bows on horseback, bro. That's kind of crazy. All right. Well, let this little archer engagement go, I guess. Eh, you know what? Charge our infantry. Charge the fellas. Some of our archers are running out of ammo anyway. And, eh, you, you guys move over here. We'll have our cavalry move, too. We'll have our cavalry charge on in there. I'm just gonna do a little disrupt in here. Cause some panic in their lines. Beautiful. Oh, 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 uh oh, uh oh, oh. Skedios. Okay, there we go. Nice. They do have more archers than us. That's one problem. This is looking like a hero unit here. Oh, well, maybe not. Might just be a sister unit. All right. Disrupting. Causing problems. Oh, hello, hero unit. There we go. Tamaria. It's now dead there, yep. Yeah. Alright. Everyone charge. Full charge. Full charge in. Please. Ow, I'm dead. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Come on. Alright. I mean, this should be pretty easy. They're getting reinforcements, that's why we're losing a little bit more. Yeah, the reinforcements coming in. But we're cutting them down pretty good. There we go. Beautiful. That's what I'm talking about. Finish that off. Whew. And then 19 more. Boom. You're my prisoner. You're my prisoner. You're my prisoner. How about that? So easy. So easy how that works. Okay. Um, sure, I will take y'all under my wing. And then... I'll take all that, sure. Alright, cool. <laughs> Such an easy clap, dude. Such an easy clap. Okay, so here's the question. Well, first of all, we have a bunch more upgrades. Good. And then, can we, like, get this guy to join us? Not you. Can you not do this while they're your prisoner? Is this not a thing? Okay, that's not going to work. <laughs> um, that's annoying. That is very, very annoying. I'm, I'm so struggling with acquiring vassals, guys. Acquiring vassals is not something we are managing to do in the slightest here. That's bad. Just need to be able to acquire them. But they cannot. 
I just really can't. I can't figure out how. Just can't do it. Um, oh, you guys are poor. Huh. Well then. Um. Oh wow, there's some good armor in here. That's why... Um... Y'all are so poor. It make a sense. Here, I'll take that, and then actually take my good horses back. There you go. Ransom those guys. We'll take some Imperial Caravan Guards as well. Alrighty then. Whew. Okay. So we've made some strides this episode. We've definitely done a lot of rebuilding, which is super nice, but I think we are going to go ahead and leave this episode here. I really do appreciate y'all watching. Thank you so much. Um, please comment down below if you guys have any tips for me making vassals. Because this is a struggle right now, getting vassals. Like, a, I'm just not managing to do it. I, I don't know what to do. Oh, this guy might, might be able to trap him. Wait, hold up. Entrapment, entrapment. Come on. Come, oh my god, he's so close. Come on, bro. Come on. Come on. Yeah, slow down in the woods. Slow down in the woods. Urgh! Oh my god. Come on. Brother. Alright, now I'm committed. We're gonna we're gonna capture this guy. Um, but yeah, if you guys will comment down below, that'd be awesome. Yes, Come we caught up. Closer. Okay. What up? Um oh, It's a Dr. Oros. Bro, all right, fine. Then we're just gonna kill you. Bye bye. <laughs> there you have it. There you have it. Okay, that's so annoying. I have to talk to the heads of family. Ooh. All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. All that good stuff. I'll see you on the next one. Peace. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Be sure to click that subscribe button for more content and hit the notification bell if you'd like to be alerted to whenever I live stream or upload. Thanks so much.